friends, how's it going? Welcome to the top 10 Pokemon TCG opening videos for the month of January. As you may already know, we took a month off in December to make sure that everything would be super awesome for 2016's list. Hello guys, welcome to... Oh wait, you, you already did that. Don't worry, I, I knew that, I swear. <laughs> Anywho guys, this is the first month in our small series called the top 10 Pokemon videos of the month, The Return of Kabu Top Stop. Basically, we're using the power of these videos and an ancient myth to try and bring back our good friend. Right, Flamliz? That is correct, Fredo. That's why we brought our good friend Mimi to help us out and increase the power of awesomeness that this video holds. Hey, Excavators! It's me, Pokemon Excavation! Or Mimi, if you please. Mimi, it's, it's really nice to have you join us. As part of the prophecy, we need a guest every month leading up to our one-year anniversary. And you are our first! So, with that out of the way, we'd like to remind you that the videos contain spoilers. You know, the ones in this video. So we encourage you to head into the description and check out all of these cool videos before continuing. That's right. They're also always in alphabetical order, so don't go into the description hoping that you'll figure out the order of this video. Alright, Mimi, kick us off. Alright guys, first on the list for this month... Oh man, I can't believe I'm here doing this! The first on this list is Trainer Chip. New to the list. Take a look at how cool this is. He gets... Two EXs. And then the rare in the pack is, ooh, a Houndoom EX. Very nice. Good way to start there with an EX pull. Ooh, oh my gosh, what? A Mega Houndoom EX. So in just two random packs, we get a Houndoom and a Mega Houndoom. How cool is that? God, debuts are the best possible thing ever. I love debuts, especially when we have two in a row. Up next is a new PokeTuber, new to me and most likely everyone watching, named National Evolution. In this opening, he instantly gets banned. Wait, eh, actually, I think I got that wrong. He pulls a banned card in full art form. A reverse is a Jellicent, which is a reverse rare, and then a- Whoa! Oh! Oh, okay! Oh, okay, okay! Okay! Oh my gosh, I kind of lost myself there for a second. A full art. <gasps> full art Lysander's trump card. Oh my gosh. Guys. Oh! oh. <laughs> Snap! Okay! And then a hollow Diancie. Oh my gosh. Guys, this is unreal. This is not wait. What's better than two new people in a row? How does three new people in a row sound? Next up, Seismitoad TCG opens one of my personal favorite boxes, the Tyrantrum EX box, and pulls a variety of cards from a variety of packs. And a rare... So, Waylord EX Full Art. That's pretty cool. That's actually a decent card. I'm actually pretty happy about that pull. It's a Verizion Hollow. So... We got a hollow and a full art. That's pretty good pulls. It's a Mega T-Tar EX. That's awesome, because I actually have a Tyranitar EX full art, so that's actually really cool. Jeez, so many debuts already, and so many freaking great cards! This is completely insane. Let's follow it up, though, with a guy that is no stranger to the list, opening up some pre-release packs of the brand new set of Breakpoint. Friend of the program and former co-host, 8-Bit Bach, everybody. Can you say hashtag two ultras one pack? Slow roll and then the rare. Hey, a sweet coon hollow, not bad. No way, a Trevin and Frank, awesome. And then the rare. Oh, look at that. Oh, wow. Mega. Look at this. Whoa. Look at this. Whoa. Whoa. And hey, hey. An another Trevin and Frank. Nice, two of them. And then the rare. Whoa, look at that again. Oh, wow. Awesome. Man up Okay, so this is funny, obviously. Second two ultra rare pack. Yeah. As somebody who was actually there when 8-Bit Bach opened his packs, they were truly radiant. I mean, who else has pulled a break and another ultra rare in the same pack twice in one day? Enough talking about Andrew's brilliance, though. I'm just saying those things to prolong the embarrassment of having to say this again. Uh, number six this month is my own video, and I definitely didn't plan it this way for yet another list. Let's hear my voice some more in a video that contains three packs, three ultra rares, and one excited me. A Giovanni Ski Reverse, and then wow, awesome, right off the bat, I'm, I'm moving my light there, sorry. We've got a Mega Mewtwo XEX, how awesome is that, guys? That is so cool. Wow, really? Oh my gosh! Okay, so, Glalie and I have a weird history, but this is a nice four-point card, a full art Glalie EX. This is incredible, guys. Wow, we did it again! We got a Mega Houndoom EX! Another 
player card that we got in our last breakthrough opening, so wow, three for three. Aw, uh, Flamliz, your video was awesome. No need to be embarrassed. Besides, three ultra rares is an awesome achievement. Sometimes, though, you can get on this list even with one good pull. Here is Pokemon with a secret rare. Woohoo! I think there's something, there's something in this pack. Oh! <laughs> yes! Yes! A secret rare trainer's mail! Guys, look at that! <laughs> Thanks, Mimi. I appreciate it. And check out Pokemart coming back to the list, too. Even though we like old friends, we always love to say hello to new ones. Number four this month goes to Brody Amity TCG, who opens an incredible breakthrough elite trainer box. We got Grand Ball. Okay, nice. So we're kicking it off strong. We have three points on the board with a Chesnaught break. A Giovanni scheme full art. Okay, so this, um, me and Giovanni go way back to my pre-release. This was actually the, f the first full art I ever pulled from Breakthrough. No way. We felt a full art indeed. We got a Mega Glalie EX full art. What an elite trainer box. That was just crazy. Aw oh, man, what a cool elite trainer box. Brody sure is on the rise. Next up is Master Jigglypuff as he gets the cycle of Pokemon cards with a hollow, an EX, a full art, and a secret rare. Talk about having the epitome of good luck. Makes you wonder what could be better. <laughs> Reverse Thug Life Inke and Beautifly Hollow. Silver and Gold. Oh, wow. Secret Beautiful. Rare Energy Switch. I am nice. Thunderous <laughs> EX Full Art. You so, uh, quoting another one, uh, Unlisted Leaf. Hydrogen EX. Nice. So, not nice. bad at all with that awesome Dragon Road. And Shred. Shred's actually not a bad attack. I bet you thought Brody was God. Well, uh, he's not. Kinda. Our next spot is taken by the person he was actually battling in his video we featured earlier on in the list, Poke Nation. Basically, judging by her placing on this list above him, you can probably assume that she won. Cue the video. A reverse Ralph, which is just a common and a rare, a Zoroark hollow. Speak of the devil himself, we have another Zoroark break. Woo! Speak of the devil again, we have the floor just break. One of the only breaks I needed left, or the only break. A Xerneas hollow. Brings us to 10 points, oh my. <gasps> oh my god, oh my god, guys. <gasps> this has been sitting on my desk for two weeks and I have not opened it. All right, put that down carefully, shall we? It's amazing that we had both halves of a battle on the same list. What a month this has been. Now we top it off in the best way possible as our number one spot goes to Flygon, who opens a pop four box with his namesake that seriously deserves a gold medal. That's right, this list gets to celebrate a gold star poll. A reverse hollow, common Cyndaquil, that is awesome. Just amazing artwork. Wow. And the rare. Oh, holy, oh my god, no. What? Holy, uh oh, what the? Oh, holy, what? What? An NJ Gold Star. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. This is the best opening on my channel. Hands down. No questions asked. This is the best. Oh wow. One of these hollow energies. This is so cool. Oh my god. This is the best opening on my channel. I guarantee you this is insane. No way. Oh wow. And... Oh! Oh, wow. Oh my god. This is insanity. Pure insanity. A Deoxys Delta Species Hollow. Oh my god. And, and the water energy. What a 750 subscribers special. Wow, guys. What a fantastic list you put together this month. Who would have thought we'd see a gold star pull? Thank you so much for having me on this list. I couldn't be more thrilled. You see, that's just the kind of thing you need to be prepared for in our line of work, Mimi. An insane pull out of nowhere. A gold star. Plus, such a great pull helps us get some of the power we need to use that machine to bring back Kabutops from his fossil. Yes, absolutely. The cooler the pull, the more power the machine gets. The best part about it is that it doesn't use fossil fuels at all. Though I suppose that is the point, since Kabutops is a fossil. Well, anyway, 
Big thanks to Mimi for increasing the awesomeness level even further for this episode, and make sure to subscribe to both her and Fredo Mon's channels. Yes, of course! Plus, next month, when we have yet another huge guest to help us out, you'll only be able to find the awesome videos featured and our guest over on my channel, so that's a little extra incentive to go over there and subscribe. With that, though, I think we're done here. Huh, Flam Liz? I'd say so. As always, thanks for watching, everybody, and we'll catch you all on the flip, flip side. side.